Okay. I push it's lovely to sit back and reflect on 240 hours, which we, we uh, are all but up. Mm -hmm. And uh, I suppose uh, you know, one of the things that we've got to know each other quite well over the last uh, week or two, because we've been working on some serious you know, First of all, on, on behalf of Silver College, I really want to thank you mm -hmm. for taking the opportunity to come along here and do your internship. Mm -hmm. Very different in a school. Yes. Uh, if I said to you, what were your expectations that you'd be doing in a school before you turned up? Yeah. Uh, yeah. First of all, I really thanks to the Sylvite College. They gave me the opportunity as an intern here. Uh, before, I haven't any experience, but before I started here, I a little bit shy. Mm -hmm. uh, how work there but my expectation like I want to learn something different because I recently finished my masters but I haven't any experience so it's my first time to get experience so I want to learn like teamwork leadership skills everything I want to learn here so um, but I really enjoyed my internship at Servite College because they gave me opportunity to work in every part uh, of the Savite College so I really thanks to like my supervisor you always encourage me to work uh, to participate in their grant in your grant website so yeah trying trying to give you an experience Cushy uh, is like trying to um, spell your name it took me nearly uh, 240 hours to get the KHUSI yeah. which I have <laughs> but um, Working at Servite College and in such a, uh, a multicultural school, yes, yeah. I think, I, and I'm hoping that you've got to understand the way an Australian yes. society runs. Yeah. So, how would you say it's different from, say, back home if you were back home in in the Punjab area? Yes. What, what What's different about working in an Australian culture? Yeah. Um, I already spent uh, more than 10 weeks here, so I really enjoyed because I uh, meet with different students, they belong to different cultures, so it's a good time to learn about their uh, cultures as well. Mm -hmm. So in my country is uh, not a multicultural, but here I got uh, in at Sir White College multicultural uh, students and staff members, so I got an ample amount of knowledge uh, get from here, so it's really helpful. For me. How about the fact that you're working? amongst the whole pile of guys and including our other intern on Wednesdays we had Kush, Tim, Clinton, Trevor, James, we're, we're talking about four or five big fellas, you know, uh, I'm very noisy yes. and uh, out in the back room we've got John yeah. and Jonathan, yeah. how did you find as the the voice of a of, of female in, in, in a male dominated place that this one is? Yeah, uh, no, now I got idea and now I know where is sitting the Clinton, where is sitting my supervisor, where is sitting the Jonathan. So yeah, now I know very well. But it wasn't it wasn't confronting that everyone in the workplace was male. Uh, yeah, sometimes I so, felt yeah, sometimes I felt because uh, no lady uh, here. So, but I really enjoyed because in my country, I like I spent most of time with uh, ladies, but it's first time I spent whole time with males. Okay, yeah. right, so that is very, very interesting. Yes. Now, you know, we're, we've been working on some fairly heavy stuff in the lip guides, and you yes. know, one, 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 of, one of the parts now, and you can sort of see in a school, the traditional librarian, yes. yeah. is, is, is the place is changing where they're trying to implement literature and books and technology together, and all at, at different successes. And today we're working on water, yeah. the other day we're working on circus. Yes. You've worked on a lot of ideas. Yeah. Uh, I, when I, I did a reflection interview with Muhammad, we were talking about how you had to go to a classroom and present some work, yes. and we, we developed a lib guide on networks, which we've got a bit of idea. Yes. How easy is it to transition to find materials for students when you wouldn't even have thought that you were a teacher? Uh, yeah, it was like... Um very, first of all, I felt very shy because mm. it was my first time, but the most of, um, I think, I got a confidence that day. Because before, when I speak in front of everyone, I felt shy, mm. but that day I uh, got confidence. So uh, I gave a lecture in front of uh, students and uh, so yeah. It's ah. a good opportunity for us. Photography on an iPad, have you got a bit of advice yes, there? Yes, yeah. 
that was also um, my first experience because in my uh, in my country uh, like uh, totally different uh, uh, student life from here mm. so i got different ideas from mm. survive uh, college but one of, one of the experiences we're really really trying to give you a uh, cushion and it comes through in different ways and, and i've been deliberately doing it over the last few days I'm giving you a whole pile of photos with uh, not much direction, this is where I want them, it's your creation, you put them there, uh, but you've had to use maybe an iPad, maybe a Windows machine, yes. you've, got to, you've got to work out how, how we, we get devices, so flexibility is really, really important mm -hmm. uh, where, where we want to go there. So from here, mm -hmm. your background, your study, you've got some degrees, what, what are your degrees in? Uh, I already did my bachelor's in computer science and uh, in, uh, in Australia recently I finished my master's in computer science. So where, you know, where we look up the paper, we don't look in the paper that much anymore, we're out on seek.com, yes. uh, we're asking people, we keep our ears to the ground, where are you looking for opportunities in the coming months? Um, in seek maybe? Mm. I already apply to many jobs every day. Uh, 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 I apply. I'm applying mm. jobs on a seat. Yeah. Recently, my friend got a job through the seat. Uh -huh. Yes. So what? 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 I think. You know, and, and I encourage you to talk about your experiences here. You know, mm. the, the way that you grew in confidence, the way you you're prepared to take on different tasks because yes. sometimes to get into the workforce you've got to start somewhere mm -hmm. and then then the opportunity happens so if you were to talk to any young ladies back at NIT mm -hmm. who were prospectively looking for a work placement would you recommend that they come here as yes, an opportunity? Of course. Yes of course uh, I prefer to uh, um, working as an intern in Servite College because before I'm here I felt shy but all the staff members are very friendly at Servite College uh, so my particular job is not here in the help desk I do the scanning for teachers so that I'm working on the live guides timely can calendar so everyone is very friendly and involved to me in their uh, in their personal uh, personal work as well so I definitely uh, to, uh, tell to the uh, NIT member if they want to join in the Survite College. So as we sign off and I say thank you, uh, I believe you have a big job for Tony at the moment. What's, yes. What is that job in there? Uh, just scanning the documents, students' uh, exam papers. Just so if we can explain when you just say just scanning the documents, in, in, in some technical, suddenly the, the, the people who certify our VET certificates are saying, we don't want them in, in a paper format, we need it in, in digital. And you're selling yourself short there a bit because you work with Tim and yes. you put them into a process yeah. yes. uh, and the teachers are disorganised and they've got all these paper, but uh, you've helped find a way to solve the problem that the cert certification people yes. are needing. Yeah. So yeah. when you just say it's just doing this, there's a lot to that process. So Cushy, thank you so I much. Thank you. Yeah, thank you and so much. Enjoy Shai. the rest of your thank time. Thank you so much. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers.